the slowest growing platform. It's the worst managed. It's a terrible company. I, it should, a takeout price for that company should be twenty twenty five dollars okay. That makes sense. Now, he's overpaying by about 40%. He needs to go in there and just get the whacking stick out and start from scratch. Why is he doing this in the first place? And I think there's a good reason. Um, Tesla and SpaceX and all of his other initiatives pay zero dollars in advertising, nothing. It's the only car company on earth that size that pays nothing in advertising. How did he do it? He did it on the back of Twitter and other social media platforms. Very few people get to own their own unregulated network, which is what Twitter is. So, you know, barring the price, which obviously he's overpaying for, he has a hundred million plus followers. Now, but he had the hundred million plus followers, whether he owned the asset or not. But he doesn't control the narrative there. He doesn't control the platform. And frankly, it is, you know, Iger himself said we didn't buy this at Disney because it's just loaded with bots. And it's the slowest growing platform. It's the worst managed. It's a terrible company. I, I'm sorry to say that, but I use the platform too. And I look at all the metrics on, uh, versus all the other ones, including TikTok and LinkedIn and, and Instagram and Facebook. It's the worst in terms of getting your message out. Now, if he gets control of this thing at whatever price and fixes it and allows it to be a true narrative where every voice is heard because I don't like this canceling this politician canceling that politician it, then it's a world platform but then it's maybe worth it but but, I, but if he can't get the debt markets um, well so that's the question does he get the debt markets you hear Apollo other 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 folks who are going to put equity in obviously at a, com a company that was worth uh, what do you say if he was buying at 44, what do you think? Unaffected, it's worth 15, 18. Million yeah, the stock goes today. down to 15 bucks if he, the deal falls apart. Maybe 12. It should a takeout price for that company should be 20, 25 dollars. Okay. That makes sense. Now he's overpaying by about 40 percent. But if he, if we don't get access, if he doesn't get access to the debt market, this deal ain't going to happen no matter what you want to litigate on because you have to be able to finance the delta. He can't all sell all of his his uh, Tesla yeah, stuff. Yeah, how much is left though? I thought he had financing for. Looks like he's ten billion out of the thirteen. Yeah, he, the banks are on the banks look, are on the line for a lot of that though. He, he's six billion shy right now, and so maybe the better deal is to say, "Give me six billion and a haircut on it, and I'll close." You know, that's not too much of a haircut. But is on that Twitter is for Twitter to say that? I mean, Twitter probably feels like they've got a stronger hand. Whether you can come up with the financing or not, you signed the deal. Right. You gave away your. Yeah, I, I, I heard all that, but between there and throwing him in jail is a long time. <laughs> I don't see anybody throwing him in but, jail. But my, that's yeah. my point. I mean, if I'm him and I'm saying, look, this is getting frustrating. I can't negotiate something uh, realistic. Let's go the journey down through litigation. Let's go. And I know you've been saying, Andrew, the judge is favoring Twitter. You don't know what's going to happen in litigation. Poo poo happens. You, you don't know what's going to happen in litigation. I'm just saying. You, I think if you if you read the tea leaves of this judge thus far, and I think it's by the way, Elon Musk's reading the same tea leaves. That's why we're back at 5420. Yeah. It's it's not in his favor. Now he can play this. He can play this out for some period of time, and that obviously puts pressure on the Twitter board. There's no question in terms of the timing piece, but. Well, I, I happen to have watched, watched him forever, and I think this guy is, you know, Teflon man, and he, ha he can obviously multitask. I bet on him on this deal. By the time all this stuff is over, I think he's going to have a good outcome. Every one of us is using, like, the modern-day Reuters, not just domestically, globally. There is new ideas on how to monetize this thing that haven't been tried. You know, that board on Twitter, many of them don't even have Twitter accounts. I mean, that that should be... I'm, what? Who doesn't have a Twitter account on that board? Find any of those board members tweeting. They better have some way. At least I, don't think, at least I, don't know, I think some of them are not tweeting. Do I think that they have uh, either burner or private accounts? You should use sure. your product if you're governing it, Agreed. shouldn't you? Agree. I mean, come on. That, that, they, he needs to go in there and just get the whacking stick out and start from scratch.